Oh, uh, look at this. Yeah, wow. they gave the 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 Pope. Uh, they gave him uh, an Indian headdress, and there he is, all slumped over with this gigantic uh, feathered headdress on, and he apologized for all of the wrongs that Christians have done to their people. But who well, gave no. them the headdress? This was a Canada thing, right? Yeah, it was in Canada. Yeah. So he was apologizing for all those like natives that died in the schools? That was the main thing, but then yep. he more broadly apologized yeah. for all the other stuff. Yeah, he for Christians. He went out of his way, by the way, to apologize for all Christians. Like, you know what? Whatever Methodists did to Indians, that's not my problem. Yeah. 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 Not my problem. I'm a yeah. Catholic. Yep. Yeah. Sorry. They picked the wrong religion. Yeah, you can only you. apologize for yourself. Yeah. You know, that's you know, all you can do. Fucking denim yourself. pope in his fucking. So, anyways, jeans. they gave do. him this, right? Yeah. They gave him the headdress. These indigenous people that he's up on stage with, right? Yeah. So yeah. What are we? I mean, who's apologizing? I when when they give it to you, there's got to be that that split second decision. Oh, where he's going like, to be rude and say no. Do I do this or like? Oh, hey, I'm the pope. Did right. he take off his little cap? Do you his know what little I mean, pope though? cap to put that on. These old people who have never been on the internet or don't go on it very much other than to like badly Google Maps something, Uh give him a headdress as a sign of like... Thanks or whatever. What's the Pope gonna be like? Like, no, no, people will be mad on the Twitter. Exactly. I cannot do it. Ugh, people who hate the fucking boy. Pope anyway, right? Like, I guess, man. I, I just... think there's more people that need to apologize than just him. Do you know what I mean? Like, he didn't buy this and show up wearing it. Maybe do you know what I mean. But what if he went to a ho- one of those Halloween stores? Um, and then just bought that and was just like, oh, fuck. For I got to sure, meet these be, goddamn Indians today. For sure. What am I going to put on? Can I change your opinion of the Pope real quick? Sure. Go ahead. Did you know? Uh-huh. And I learned this on our episode because of Rob. Uh, he was a bouncer at a club in uh, Argentina. This yeah, Pope? Be- yeah. Yeah, because widely known that this Pope parties, right? This is the cool Pope. Yeah, this is the cool Pope. And he was fucking people up in where? Brazil? Yeah. No, no. Argentina. Oh, Argentina. That's some rough and tumble shit down there. Bouncer. Yeah, bouncer. The Pope was a fucking bouncer. He probably killed somebody with a rock and then found Jesus afterwards. I bet it was. What made him turn to Jesus after being a a bouncer? Because there's always one thing where it's like, all right. Dan was saying, like, he's probably selling drugs. Bouncer. Was he selling coke down in Argentina? Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's selling drugs, right? Selling drugs. Yeah, he's on that white. He's on that fucking sniffy, dog. He's he's supplying to the people. Well, he was a vessel of. Is that the Pope in a roadhouse poster? This is from an article of mine from back in the day. Come on, dude, pop that up. This is Bob's day. I can't. This is Bob's day. Oh, it's yeah. Yeah, it's it's Ah. it's all archived. Well, Ah, blow it up. There we go. There you go. It's best I can do. The Pope nice. and Roadhouse. Nice. Fucking shit up, dude. I'd love to see it. So I'm assuming he had crazy sex as well, because that comes with being a bouncer, where it's just like, all right, he's taking girls home from the club. Yeah, he's Shit fucked. like that. He fucked, right? He fucked. He fucked. He sold cocaine. Yeah. So the, the Pope is part of the Jesuit order, this Pope is, in okay. particular. And those are widely known as kind of like the fast and loose hippies in the Catholic church or All whatever. Right. They're a little more like, they're a little cooler with like weed and stuff like mm-hmm. that. They're a little more like, I guess socially liberal would be the way to put it, to be honest. Right. Like, uh, yeah. So the Pope did coke, yes. kicked the shit out of people, killed somebody with a rock, was probably selling and smoking weed and then having graphic unprotected sex. And then he found Jesus later on. Right. Well, listen. no, he's always been the vessel. Yeah, and so it's it's that's oh, what God so that's wanted him God, to do. Oh, so God wanted him to do that. Yeah, All right, yeah. that's God's plan. Mm-hmm. Okay, and they ha- I mean they had to completely overcompensate for the last Pope who retired, by the way, but was also part of Hitler Youth. Yeah, fuck that guy. I never liked that Pope. I never liked that Pope at all. Yeah. Um, I don't like this guy either very much. But uh, when are we going to get the Jude Law, the sexy young Pope in there? Like, let's fucking do it. Let's get that somebody hot. that's attractive. That way, when the scandals go down where, you know, they're fucking nuns or whatever, at least you can kind of get into it where you're like, all right, yeah, I can watch that guy fuck. Pull, pull up the Jude it's Law never Pope. that, though. Pull up the young Pope, Jude Law. There's one of him in, like, a, a tiny Euro bathing suit. That's the Pope that I want. I actually want Jude Law to be the Pope. What's, yeah. what's he doing these days? Is he doing anything? The Pope pays more than movies does. Is Jude Law to. doing anything? I yeah. think so. 
He's always kind of working on something. There it is. Pop that up on screen. This is for the ladies today out there. That's what that's what I want our Pope to do right there. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Okay? That's a fucking young Pope we can all get behind. Right there. Yeah. And then if he's got some sexual scandals in the church, who gives a shit? Right. Because you're picturing a hot, attractive man just boning nuns, and then you can move on with your life. Nobody's really going to care if it's attractive. The problem is they don't bone nuns. Are you sure? From what I've heard of Bob. the Catholic Church, I don't know. Hmm? What do we got, Bob? For what? I think I think he's laying. I think most of the popes are laying laying pipe. With oh, the historically, nuns. yes, yes. Well, there we go. Kids and shit. I mean, God damn it! They were just kings. They were just fucking banging yeah. constantly. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. It was the people under them. Look, I don't know. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. Look, I don't know. <laughs> Good for him. Unproven. I just don't want to picture an old bag of shit like that banging nuns. Like, I don't want that. I want a younger guy that I can get into and get behind, you know? I like that you can't stop yourself from picturing it. Me? Yeah. Oh, I, I have to. I just don't want a picture. I don't want a picture. I have to. Like, this guy. <laughs> pop him up. So Who's I, this fucking this dude? This is the, uh, let me look up his name again. He is the youngest cardinal. Okay. Oh, Giorgio, Mareng- Giorgio Marengo. Watch out mm. for Giorgio Marengo. Yeah. yeah, look at those. Put put it, put him back up on screen. Look at that eyewear. That's that's some serial killer eyewear. Nobody wears that voluntarily unless you're you're a serial killer or you're touching kids. Yeah, not hot enough for me. No, like go to fucking what's what is it? Uh, who was our sponsor for a long time on the show? Felix Gray. Yeah, go to Felix Gray. Get some attractive glasses and then come back and and like smooth up. Make the beard look cool. Go with sideburns. Maybe some of those wolf, like those Wolfman, right. Hugh Jackman, straight Hugh Jackman, Wolfman sideburns. Sure, but why is he doing that? For who? Just for the, the image. Like, let's sex it up. Like, cardinals aren't sexy. I don't even know what they do. What does a cardinal do? They don't have It's more sex. of a title. I mean, it's yeah. just like a it's just like a archbishop that got promoted. Right. But before Deion but Sanders made made cornerbacks sexy and the cornerback position sexy, nobody cared about cornerbacks. Let's make us care about cardinals. Let's sex this guy up. You know? Gosh. I'm just saying, it would help. Because at the end of the day, we're all passing around baskets asking for money. Uh-huh. It'd be a lot easier if you were attractive and be like, all right, yeah, maybe I'll throw him an extra 20. Yeah. You know? Women hide money all the time from husbands. You think they're not pulling out extra wads from the side purse where the tissues are, and they're just kind of stuffing it in? Now, imagine if he was hot and cool, and maybe you wanted to bang him. You'd throw an extra 20 in there, you know? I mean, write a letter, see. I will. Write a letter. We all know that I do that in all of my spare time. I write (laughs) my congressman, senators, president. I write the president every day. And then I'll— Now I'm just going to add the cardinal to that. Yeah. I am. Uh, and you're going to ask them what? To sex up the... Sex up the, mm-hmm. the church. Let's sex up let's the whole thing. Let's go word thing. for word. Dear... Dear no, Cardinal... <laughs> what's it? Cardinal Johnson? Can you please... Am I, is, that, is that off the cuff? Is it not Cardinal Johnson? Skippy Roy Johnson? With those glasses, that's a three-named guy right there. It's a James Earl Johnson. James Earl Ray, James Earl Johnson. Let's sex him up. Dear Cardinal James Earl Johnson. Can you please sex yourself up? Mm-hmm. And by sex, I mean, let's get rid of the glasses. Mm-hmm. Maybe put in some fun, flirty contacts that are blue, like the, the sexy con. Remember the hot con that was for a while? He had the blue, the blue eyes, the black eye. Right. And they, he impregnated the billionaire's oh, the daughter hot, on the yacht. Hot yeah, con. Prisoner. Hot yeah, prisoner let's throw that in. Yeah. Let's, sha- let's get a nice, clean, tight shave on that beard. Yep. Make it look like Dan Holloway's. I don't know who does... Dan's beard work, mm-hmm. but it's nice. And it's always nicely trimmed. You ever smell it? What? Yeah. You ever smell it? You ever have a walk by of Holloway when he walks by? I don't. It, there is a sense, and I forget what the product is. It might be Vainglory. Uh, whatever it is. It smells delicious. You got to do the whole thing. I will d- And then obviously, check it out. last but not least, you go no underwear, no boxers. You're, all, you're wearing a robe anyways. Let people see it. Let a breeze go by. Mm-hmm. Let it, just give it a little tap. Just let the head peek out where you're just like, oh, all right, cool. So you can see it when he walks because there's a lot lot, lot of walking and then you're swishing candles and shit and whatever the smoke is in the church, let the dong kind of hit the robe all the way down. Then the money starts really coming in, Jabes. Yeah, I just think as far as like the branding, Mm -hmm. Catholic 
church. Right. I think they're trying to to stay away from that. You think they're trying to stuff. distance from that? Yeah. Uh, I yeah. say dong it out. Let, okay. Let, let's have that dong hit the robe. Just graze the robe from side to side. Maybe we maybe we switch the uh, the robe to like a, a gray sweater material. Oh, like a, 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 gray, a gray sweatpant. A gray jersey. A gray sweatpant. Mm-hmm. I heard that episode of you guys on Broettes where you were talking about uh, dudes in gray sweatpants right. and it makes your dick look bigger. Let's do that. Maybe tuck the robe inside gray sweatpants. No boxers, no underwear. Let that dong, let that hog out. Gosh, I'd love to button up this conversation. Well, we're not going to. I, I don't even know if we've started yet, <laughs> Jesse, of where I really want to go with this today. Okay? Yes. Throw a half inch of cocoa butter. All the way, you got to go chest first. We go beach muscles first on the young cardinal here, okay? Flex it up. Let's cut the fucking sleeves off that robe and go full Delco. Go full Delco with it. Let's cut the sleeves off of it and then see what happens. But none now of we're that getting stuff sexy. I'm, I'm, finding, I'm finding attractive. Well, you it would. more like a... I think you would if you just gave it a shot, Jabes. No. Instead, we're stuck in this million-year-old tradition where it's a long red robe, and there's, mm-hmm. there's no place to go but down.